Tellum Tribe Tarot. Daily readings for my tribe. Subscribe to my channel. Hi, I am Cherokee with Tellum Tribe Tarot. And I wanted to talk to y'all about love. Loving the right way. Like a lot of us may feel as if we don't deserve love or we wouldn't recognize love when it comes because we're not so sure what it feels like or how it's supposed to treat us or what we're supposed to do with it. Energetically, we're built, we're manufactured with love. We were manufactured in love. And if you notice, whenever you're by yourself for too long, you may feel despondent, alone, anxious, depressed. When you feel like the world is against you because you've disconnected from source, love, and isolated yourself, you feel as if you're empty, you're, you're in the shadows. But the moment that you have some type of interaction, whether it's with a friend, albeit it's with family, or people that are valuable to you, or not even, even a stranger that shows you some type of kindness, that's a, a version of love. It, it fills you with light. It inspires you. This love that we have innate within us is something that we're supposed to practice all the time and grow like a muscle so that no matter if it's being shown to us, we have the ability and the drive to project it so that it can inspire someone else. And you're not doing it to be inspirational. You should be doing it because it feels good for you. Why do you think feeling good is so important? Feeling good is important, not because you're necessarily here to serve the world, although as human beings, we serve each other, we coexist, we help each other, that's what we're here for. But in order to serve, you must fulfill yourself first, right? Just like on a plane when the oxygen masks fall down in the midst of an emergency landing, you have to give yourself oxygen first before you can even help your own child or your loved one. Because if you're not okay, you cannot help anyone else. You will run out of oxygen. You will deprive yourself of love. You will, your reservoir will deplete and you will begin to feel worthless and used and manipulated and as if you're not enough. So today, focus on love, loving on yourself. Focus on giving yourself what you need to breathe. What makes you happy? What makes you strive? What makes you feel good? And once you figure that out, which is not hard, the first thing that comes to mind, what makes me feel good? For me, it's going to the beach, smelling the salt water, the air, rolling around on my blanket on the, on the beach, jumping in the water, dipping my hair, being happy. And that inspires people even in a distance to just be happy with themselves as well. So what do you love? Do you love to eat? Or do you love to cook? Do you love to exercise? Whatever that looks like for you, do that and do it with love. Do it with glee, do it with gratitude and you will see so many changes with that small act. Acknowledge where you are and acknowledge the love that you want to manifest within yourself. And you do that, you take those steps with you first before you try to share anything with anyone else. You do that for you and you will see 
how those things will affect your life in a positive way in every aspect of your life. It starts with love. I hope this message resonates. The lovers, tribe. <laughs>